Welcome back guys to MLB The Show 16 making this video right after the last one. Three game home series against the Tampa Bay Rays. And I believe we are rocking a like 11 game hitting streak now. So far, our first streak in the MLB. Still on dynamic difficulty. Probably gonna play these three games on that and then move, take the move to veteran. And as you can see, dynamic difficulty is not working at all. It doesn't even move. So, four seam, two seam. Guy at second, so I want to be careful here. Let's do this. Whoa. Now this is up and in, and I don't think he likes that location much. It's ball one. And Eric, as we take a look at the Rays entering play here tonight, they come in looking to make it two in a row as they were winners last time out. And this time of year is really starting to catch up with these guys now. They Not a bad hit, but I think that might get caught. Last few games, bullpen's tired, starters are tired. Heck, well, he's probably too slow to get the third. Find a way to push through it. Now a chance here from Fenway to take a look at John Farrell's starting lineup card. Anybody catch your eye, Eric? Nobody scored yet. Stepping in, Brandon White. He flew out in his last at bat. Guy at first, one out. Someone needs to knock his ass off. So we hit a slider, I guess. I don't know what that was. No, it was a... Yeah, it was a slider. I don't know. I don't know if that window on the bottom left is showing the last guy that hit recently or if it's talking about my last at bat. I don't think it was my last one. Due to the pitch there being in somewhere in the middle and this, this one here on mine, the number two being inside. So I don't know how that works. Archer comes set. First pitch on the way. Ooh. Chopped way too low. The plate. Strike one. And that's going to land. Got lucky there. I don't think I was all over that one. 12 game hitting streak. We probably would have scored there, so it kind of sucks. I swung kind of late, but perfectly late to get it through the gap. The good news is that there's no chance really of a double play. And that should get us a score. So he gets the RBI. Now let's see if this guy can get me in. And he missed with it there, ball four. It's a two-out walk. walk with the runner still at third. And for as hot as this guy's been recently, Pablo Sandoval stands This guy's already gotten a base hit, so... And you know, some guys just get better with runners in scoring position. Let's see if this guy can do it again. right here, even though it's still early. He struck him out, and it could have been worse. It's going to be 1-0. Bases are loaded. I'm just looking for a base hit. Think small, but... Hmm. Same pitcher. Just don't know what he's going to do. First pitch on its way. Ooh. Nope. Yeah, I saw that one last time, so kind of halfway through, I was like, nope. In the inning already, he can't afford to fall behind anybody else if he wants to stay in the game. Go, 
Ooh. That could have been a pop-up, so good thing we didn't swing at that. Because I was already going low. I don't think so. Wow, that was a home run. Damn. That surprised me. That was a weird home run. So he promptly unloads the bases with that one. As the Red Sox break on I don't feel like I got all of that one. That must be just because of the way the uh, ball field is. The ballpark. Excuse me. I think that might be my first Grand Slam recorded. I don't remember. For this game. <clears throat> Being, I mean, MLB uh, 16. Of course, I have some for 14 and 15, but... Nice. And on the very... I thought I was going to get caught, but it went past him. So a really good start. Six inning, five zero guy in first two outs. And he's, he's a lefty, so gotta pay attention to that curveball and that circle change there. Wow, that was an easy pitch to hit. Another one. That was gone. Completely out of the park. Very easy pitch to hit there. And that's probably because of the rookie difficulty. So we're dominating this game, pretty much. Right down the middle, it looked like. Boom. I think I'd approach him a bit more cautiously from here on out. That's just completely gone. <laughs> Brandon White stands in again here with two home runs. Let's see if we can get a third one. I think we I don't think I recorded it, but I've already had a game where we got three home runs. It was real lucky. Let's see. We pitchers so All right, so the cutter, the curveball, and the slider. Cutter usually gets me. Curveball, hit and miss. And the pitch. Oh man, terrible. Yeah, that was really bad. I I didn't think it was going to be that inside. But. Well, what's this? Welcome back to baseball on the show from Beantown, Boston, Mass. We're set for the final innings of this one. That's pretty cool. Never seen that before. But we won the game. They didn't even score. They only got one hit. So either me or the pitcher is going to be player of the game. I would think the pitcher. And guys, you can't yep. win if you can't score. So there's probably not a whole lot of debate about who'll take home top player of the game. I forgot what you call those. One. You have to figure he'll probably be replaying that one hit. He allowed right, pick that over up. In his mind tonight. Nevertheless, he was absolutely brilliant on the mound all throughout. Mm -hmm. So that'll just about do it. For Eric Caro, Steve Lyons, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. This has been a presentation of MLB The Show. For more, don't forget to check out theshownation.com. He's trying to give love to everything here. Eight to nothing. Their abilities. All right. That aggressiveness one isn't very important because it only works for uh, game is just simulating. The as we start to wrap up the MLB pregame show, but before we go down to the action, look. Don't want to hear that again. <clears throat> Tuesday night baseball set to come your way from. So I think we've gotten used to the rookie difficulty. It seems like. To start the week. So the this game and one more, and I'm and amping it up to veteran. Get used to that. Next. Remember last year, and I think in 14, All Star was probably the most balanced for me. And here's the at the end of the day, for the visiting Tampa Bay Rays, Eric Caros, who you focused on. You know, they're getting. 
Brandon Guy at second. Stand in, and he was a big part of the win last night as he contributed three hits to his guy's effort. Well, you know, he's been averaging at least an RBI Splitter. game over his last ten, so yesterday's performance shouldn't have come as any big surprise to anybody. That should be caught. I don't... Yeah, I hope catch that. He makes the catch, and the runner from second will tag and hit yeah, At least third. that other dude's running up. And he's up to third safely now with two gone in the inning. With that, here's how the hometown Red Sox line up in this one. Eric, who should we keep an eye on? And they're up by three. Uh-oh. And he threw a cutter. And that misses inside Splitter. one. Looked like it had a slight drop. A runner on first with two away. Not sure what's so special about that one. That should be caught too. That dude is Oh he missed it! And wow, another ground rule double. And now we're at 13 games. Lucky number 13 now. That's almost two full weeks where he's been swinging it. Thought he was going to catch that one for sure. Good opportunity to get on the board. Just need a base hit here. Yeah, guys, a really big opportunity here to get his guys right back in this one. Right side. And we're not going to get it. And the two out threat will not come to pass as the inning is. That's all right. Into the box now. Brandon White. He'll try to follow up the double. Same pitcher. It looks like we had a forcing. Right here. Boy, he had a great at bat last time up, and he'll look for another pitch he can drive right here. Oh, see you later. I didn't even think that was going to be a good hit. But hell no, that was a real good hit. I just dropped it a little bit. I felt like I should have dropped it more, but good thing I didn't. Probably would have been a pop-up. I don't know. I don't want to go to Vitter. I'm liking these no-doubt home runs, but now nah, I'm going to do it. I'm just joking. Just feels good when you get them. Well, apparently, these guys didn't see the highlights from yesterday because he had two home runs a day ago. Now, he's got another home run right here. So now, obviously, this pace won't... Brandon White will stand in now. We can make it a one-point one game here. Break situation. And you think at this point, you have to get something out of this if we were to get If we were to get a home run. The tougher it's going to be to claw back from this deficit. The zone's pretty small now, so let's be careful here. First pitch of the at bat. Ooh, and damn. Boy, a high strike call there. That sucks. That's not all that consistent, but it's strike one. And you know what? These days, so many guys are throwing in the high 90s. It makes those mid to low 90s guys look easy. Gotta be careful. But I'll tell you what, if he mixes his pitches well, it can still be plenty fast to have to deal with. And we're going to get the base hit, and he should get up to third. So I'm going to go ahead and stay here, though. Boy, how much hotter is he going to get? He's got himself another three hit ball game. Hanley Ramirez gets another. Hopefully, this guy can get us in there. Full count. The ground nope, second base. and this exactly what I was fearing. Double play. Double play as we only got one more inning, and nope, we didn't win it. A tightly contested ball game here, so it makes it hard to find our top. All right, so one more game. game. But I think this fella right here would seem to be the logical choice. Yeah, you see a couple of hits for him in the ball game. This one was tight throughout, but in the end, he really helped lead his guys to this victory. And let's see what. Happens in the final game. Afternoon baseball for you now on the show. Coming your way from venerable Fenway Park here in Boston. Today the third and final game in this. They're already winning by four. Terrible pitching Brandon looks like. White will step in now. He drove in his club's only run a night ago. And he's been hitting the ball out of the yard too. A whole bunch of home runs in his last ten games. <clears throat> so and yesterday was a good one too. Guy at first, zero outs. 
Smiley comes set. Here's the first pitch. Damn. I should, if I got more underneath that, it would have been good. Not a good start. Now a chance here from Fenway to take a look. Brandon White will dig in. 0 for 1 in the ballgame. Brandon White. Damn! Home run ball right there. Just swung too early. Oh man. We had it there, guys. Now he's gonna start screwing with me. This has been a common problem for all of these guys. They just can't lay off that pitch. That ain't going nowhere. Please be foul at least. Yeah. Another chance. No runs, just one hit and one error on the Boston line score. Hot shot to third. Nope. Longoria's got it. On to first. Gosh. And the streak down. might be over. Well, it's still early, but it's also worth noting. Brandon and we got on the board. Nice. The Let's see if we can get an RBI here. Hit, get that so guy at third in. in Watch out for the double play. And I think that's in the back of his mind, but it's not something he's really focused on. I don't think so, but that should bring in a run. Sack fly. It's going to be a quick game. We're winning now. Let's see if we can keep the streak going here. New pitcher. And nope. The streak is over unless they tie it. Backward as he just put the glove up and hauled it in for the first down. Nice play. And that's one of those plays where you might need to reinforce the laces on your glove. Nope, we have another chance. <laughs> I knew they were going to probably tie it. It always does that. Chance here to extend that hitting streak. Yeah, he hasn't had the same success the rest of the guys have, but that could all change with one swing. I'm just looking at his pitches. That cutter always seems to get me. to keep it tied here it comes damn that was a cutter for sure throw just does beat him to the bag as that was pretty close it just moves game sure is giving me a lot of chances Brandon white he got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time first pitch of the at bat on its way for fastball too high to start him out here one and oh I feel like with that cutter, I gotta miss a little bit to the right in order to get it, because it looks like a fastball. That's what I keep thinking it is. Not close. No, no. It's two and zero. Oh. This is a guy whose numbers are on the rise, and this is a big reason why. Two close pitches, two good takes, and now he's in a great hitter's count. Two and zero. Oh. Damn! Unlucky. But pretty much right at the left fielder as he <laughs> I ain't getting a break in this one. Out. Two up, two down to start off the bottom half. And I guess we lost. And no, we won. A few guys we the streak is over, but we won. That's the man who out in my book. Alrighty, guys. Well, that's it for the month in the game. I think there's one more left. And uh, the record's looking pretty good for the Boston Red Sox. So I guess we'll be in the playoffs or whatever you call it. Anyways, hope you all enjoyed. Unfortunately, nothing, just an RBI in that game. But it's all good. I feel like we had some pretty good swings. Just some timing issues. That one pitch that I was early on, man, that probably would have been a home run. Just too early. Anyways, guys, hope you all enjoyed. Leave this video a like if you enjoyed, thumbs down if you disliked, subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you all in the next video.